Yeah, sorry. I was caught up watching something on YouTube, and I kind of wanted to finish watching it, but... Uh, the later I start, the more hard it is to get going. So let's just get this started. Got me a Jolly Rancher for my chronic dry mouth. Let me see, we just finished the cathedral. Supposed to walk there ourselves, the fourth library hill. Okay. Let me open up the side quests. Uh, the side quests, here we go. Let me open that. Okay, so it looks like we're headed to Ketterburg relatively soon. Yeah, I guess. I know we're supposed to um, on our way to warn Saint Bina. Eventually, there's going to be um, there's another boss fight there, and then we're gonna have to go get the thing in this game that allows us to fly around. So we're playing. Pretty close to being able to fly. Looks like no one's following us. I don't think they can abduct Ion in a public space. But what do we do now? War's about to start and things look seriously bad. Can't we just go to Batical and stop my uncle? You look seriously bad. Have you forgotten? Mose has his majesty's ear. It would be running right into enemy territory. Oh. I'm afraid Tyr may be right. Father trusts Mose. I'm also worried about the talk of St. Bina falling. Then why don't we petition help from Malkuth's Emperor Peony? He doesn't want war, and he would have gotten word of any signs of Rubnica's collapse. Sounds like a plan. Okay, let's do that. But where will we get a ship to Malkuth? Ash left the Tartarus in Doth's Harbor for us. Let's head there. He did? Okay. The harbor's northwest, right? Let's go. How do you know that? Well, I was in Ash's body, you see. Nobody cares, Luke. Just nobody cares. I wonder why Ash left the Tartarus behind. He probably wanted to help us. I wouldn't be so certain. The Tartarus is one of Malku's ships. Perhaps it was just inconvenient to use it for travel between the two countries. Well, whatever the reason, at least we won't be stranded here. Ash, I wonder what he's up to. Who knows, he may be plotting something. Guy, don't talk about Ash like an enemy, he's on our side. Really, I wonder. Personally, I'd refrain from making any hasty judgments. Just because you want him. Sexually. Yeah, almost everybody can do a mystic art. I mean, I don't think this guy is going to survive. Stop with that nonsense, sir. Well, you did your best. Yeah, I'm wondering what's the first high level spell we're gonna get for Jade. 
that battle was quite a performance. Yes, everyone's attacks flowed together so... Yeah, and mine were just perfect. Huh, my attacks worked better. Yeah, right. Of course, right here? I'll refrain from commenting on that. Just what is that supposed to mean? You know what it means, huh? Both of you need to think more about your position. Hey! Calm down, everybody. Natalia, if you would continue. That's quite alright. I guess because everybody interrupted her, I don't know. Feels a little out of place. Ow, oh, what are you, little bastard? There goes SpongeBob, ripping his pants again. So I'm gonna want random thrust anyway. Doesn't really matter what I do. That last hit always seems to not be perfect. Come on, if you don't try harder, then it's just annoying. Dang, it feels like Ooh. Now that guy has it. We can bring him into the party if we want. Until Jade learns a high level spell, it's kind of not worth it to have. I mean, he still does a lot of damage, just, you know, that's not the problem. The problem is. Uh, even though he can use his overlimit, it doesn't really do anything. Because he doesn't have. Uh, on our uh, high level art to use this spell off of. I think it like. He either gets a high level spell of 35 or 32, I forget what it is. But uh, yeah, I'm not gonna be able to use Mystic Cage quite yet. Oh, you're gonna put on anybody more useful. You're literally not gonna be in the front. Anis is a good person to have in the party. She may be annoying, but she's a pretty skilled fighter, all things considered. I implore you to reconsider. Oh, come on, dude. Don't be so obnoxious. Hey, uh, why don't you right, do that thing? There we go. You were just amazed at my arms. Sometimes you gotta give him a little push, but that's because you know he's already at half mana. Because, like I said, melee users go through it way faster than magic casters do in this game. I don't really want to waste items on it, though. Say lovey. Okay. That's what I'm saying, man. If the last hit doesn't hit, it's, like, worthless. Worthless indeed. Huh, get out of my face. 
quite worthless indeed. But Talia can do hers though, once she gets to 29. I mean 30. The whole is 29. Tears is close to, I wonder. This next battle would get her up to 30. I wonder if um, she can use the phonic arts, the phonic hymns instead of uh, actual, like, holy lines or something. Ow! Pretty. Does Guardian Field heal me or just my teammates? Just teammates. Okay, so Steel heals me for. Did I see. There was no way it was 700. Good work. Just don't get too excited. I know. Let us find out, huh? Although, using it against the birds is a bad idea. We'll find out soon enough. Whenever we fight things, it can actually take a hit from magic spells. Because even magical mystic arts will put enemies into defenseless. It's kind of stupid. The Emperor's in the capital, Grand Kokma. Where's that from here? Um, northwest, I think. Doesn't Grand Kokma turn into a fortress in wartime? Will the port be open? You're well informed. That's correct. But war hasn't started yet. Even so, I imagine they've sealed off invasion routes in preparation for an attack. But won't they let you through, Jade? Right now, mentioning my name would probably have the opposite effect. All of my men were killed and I've been missing since Axerioth. Now I show up in a land ship that was supposedly captured. Excuse me? I wouldn't be surprised if they opened fire on us. Why don't we dock somewhere and go by land? If we approach unarmed, then perhaps... Rotel Row Bridge is still under repair. We should be able to land there. That looks like our best choice. Then it's settled. Let's head for Rotel Row Bridge. Oh, <sighs> we have to walk? Walking's not so bad. I believe, um... What's his name? So we can't get to Grand Kokma yet. Nope, the Tartarus would probably sink if we tried to force our way in. Perhaps at full strength, the Tartarus could do something like that. But with this smaller crew, even that would be impossible. Besides, there's no reason to be so aggressive here. Yeah, we're not going in to fight. Besides, we'd have, prob we'd have problems if the Tartarus got too banged up. Indeed, it would likely be difficult to find another ship given the current situation. We'll need the Tartarus for a while yet. Coming up from the cliff op was pretty rough on it, so we should probably play it safe for a while. Huh? You knew about that? Yeah, I'm connected with Ash. Ash. I saw it all through his eyes. I remember it well. Hmm. In any case, all of us probably are as worn out as the Tartarus is. Let's get some rest before we move on. I wouldn't mind doing that good idea, except there's not an inn around here. No, don't think so. This doesn't even open. But yeah, it's always fun getting to level 30 because that's when combat really picks up with the Mystic Arts and whatnot. The only thing that sucks, like I showed before, is that you have to hit them with the last move of your arcane art. Like, if it has a lot of hits in it. And if you don't, you, you know, like, like I showed, you risk not being able to do it. Okay, so I know that on our way to Rotel Row, we're going to have a little thing where, oh no, we got to refuel or whatever. So it's over this way. But I'm pretty sure there's a cutscene regardless. It's just a tiny, tiny detour. Wow, looks like the Tartarus has no problem on the sea either. Yeah, it was built for both land and sea, but it's really just a land ship that happens to float. Real warships will have no problem on running it, indeed. Nonetheless, I've grown used to the Tartarus. I find it more comfortable than some fairies. Yeah, me too. Look, the Tartarus is a Malkuth craft, you know. 
Kim Laska Lanvaldir's cruise ship, the Princess Natalia, is much more enjoyable. Yeah, that sounds a lot better. Really? I think men would take the Tartarus any day. The Tartarus? How about you, Taylor? Who cares if it's women or men? The Tartarus, of course. Uh, I kind of like Tokunaga. Talking about the bear? N never mind. He can't cross the sea, though. He would sink. You gotta use your head a little bit. Whatever. The joke is that she likes cute things, and it's like, oh, isn't it weird for a girl to like cute things? And it's like, no, it's not weird for anybody to like cute things. It's not weird at all. Uh, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we can't go through. go through here, baby. Yeah, you have to watch out. There's a thunderstorm around here somewhere that you can't exactly cross. Ah! Is it going to sink? I'll take a look. I'll go too. I may be able to help if any phone machines need repair. Yeah, sure, whatever. Master, I can't swim. Don't worry, we'll be fine. I know. Don't worry. We're not going to sink. Guy managed to repair the engine damage. We should still be able to move. Man, that was fast. It's it was only like temporary. Seconds. I'd like to get it repaired in port somewhere. The closest port from here is Ketterberg. Then let's go there. That's okay with you, right, Jay? I suppose so. We weren't anywhere near Ketterberg. Don't listen to their lies. The nearest port is the story port. That's where you need to go for the story. Okay, so there's a side quest here. Excuse me. I need to confirm your passports and ship registration. I'm Colonel Jade Curtis, 3rd Division, Malkuth Imperial Forces. My apologies. But I heard you were killed at Axarioth. That matter is top secret. Our ship's engine was damaged during our mission, so we stopped here. I'll explain the situation to the governor, Viscount Osborne. You may inspect the ship as you please. Yes, sir. Shall I show you to the city? That won't be necessary. I was born here. I'm familiar with the area. Understood. Then, if you'll excuse me... Huh. So you were born here, Jade? Yes. What are we going to do about repairs? I don't we know. We can report that to the governor and ask for help. Okay, then let's hurry to Ketterberg. It's his attractive sister. My brother was a devil, and he wanted to bring back people from the dead. What's wrong? I was organizing the warehouse, but I'm totally stuck now. I can't seem to get it any more organized, and I'm wondering what to do. I'll tell you, I tell you, rich people just do have too much stuff, you know? How hard can it be to organize a warehouse? Oh sure, that's easy for you to say. You'd think otherwise if you tried it yourself. Hey, that's a great idea. You give it a try. I'll give you the treasures inside. What the? No. Said you didn't think it was hard. Prove it. You just have to drop the crates down and make a path to walk through. Will you organize the warehouse for me? Sure. Okay, okay, I'll do it. Thanks, I appreciate it. I'll give you what's inside. The treasure chest you open, but it won't. But if you open even one and then leave, I won't give you the rest. If you want to start over? Just go on out and I'll let you try it anytime. Oh, I hated these. And the music gets really old. <laughs> oh. The goal is to open all the treasure chests. Okay, we don't really need to go that way. Yeah, there's one right there, so eventually we need to bring two blocks over here to get that one. Hmm. <laughs> what to do? What to do? So. Yeah, I don't have this memorized, unfortunately. Where were we? Ah, oh, yes. Abject humiliation. 
Now we could put two in that one to push this one over here to get to that other one. But like I said, I'm not... I'm not bad at puzzles, but if I don't have them memorized, it can take me a while to figure them out. Like, I don't mind doing puzzles. There are some people who hate puzzles, but... I am fairly neutral towards them. Some of them can be. It depends on what kind of puzzle it is, I guess. But yeah, if you fail, like, if you fail, you have to restart, so... Like, we could do this, maybe. Make a bridge over here. Push this one down here. But yeah, this music does get to wear on your ears after a while. Stun bracelet. I think there was a C core on one of these warehouse side missions, but I don't remember exactly. I know that there's a doll for Annis in one of these. Rebirth doll, not that, but one of the ones that she equips. So we have one, two, three. Uh, I think that's it. There aren't any other chests to open, so we just need to put a crate right there. So this one wasn't too bad then, if that is the case. It is an earworm, it's not the catchiest song, I don't, I don't know. It sticks with you, even though it's kind of annoying. Ooh, I can't do that. I can't go around. Um, hmm. Okay, this should work. So this first one wasn't too bad. Pineapple gel. So we got a rebirth doll, pineapple gel, and the stun bracelet. Wow, you cleaned it up completely. I guess it really was easy for you. You've inspired me to work harder. Here's a token of my thanks. Obtained 5,000 gold. I'm gonna strive to be like you. Not hard, it's just tedious. I want to say that a lot lately. There's this dude I watch on YouTube called Mr. Llama. He's like a Diablo. He's pretty famous and well-respected in the Diablo 2 community. And uh, he uploaded a video recently talking about the changes for Diablo Resurrected. And you know, it just kills him that they want to put in extra inventory. And... Because, you know, it makes the game easier if you don't have to pick up stuff. I guess, you know. And it's more tedious to... These guys are pretty high level. If I remember correctly. This whole area is pretty high level for where we are right now. Tough! 8,000 health. I mean, it's not the... Like, 200. We can maybe survive. You just got to be careful not to be hit by too many of their attacks. But yeah, you, we don't come back to this area until way later in the game. Much, much, much later. Ooh, 16,000. That's a good HP from an early game boss. Ow. Wait it. Alright, and let's finish the job. Oh, why don't you use your Mr. Card? You fool. Hey, shut up. I want to say sometimes when they do that, they summon more birds to fight us. But see, as you can see, like 800 experience, that's like double what we were earning. So you can grind here a little bit if you want.